So I thought it might be good to get outside and do a video in the, in the outside world. Behind me, you have the Wasatch Mountains here in Salt Lake City. Uh, and we're in the foothills of the Wasatch. Um, the topic today is, it actually came up just recently that I thought worth doing a video on LinkedIn and the do's and don'ts of LinkedIn. So I've got five things I'll talk about in this video that relate to LinkedIn and geospatial. And remember, when you're building, doing work in social media, you're building a community. Really, it's people that share your same purpose, have your same interests. So always keep that in mind. You're really community building. You're connecting with other people using this new medium that we, that we call social media. So my five do's and don'ts. Remember the community. When you're advertising in LinkedIn, you are not building a community. You're turning people away. If you have a product in there, if you have a reach back to me about something very specific and it feels like selling, you're not building a community. So number one, don't sell in LinkedIn. Number two, create your own content. Seriously, it's a hard thing to get started with, but once you start building your own content, it's amazing how many people gravitate to you because they share the same interests as you. So whether it's doing videos like this, whether it's going out there and creating other types of content, um, it's really important you create your own stuff and you can be controversial. I mean, I try to be a little bit controversial at times, not offensive, but somewhat controversial because your goal is to stimulate conversation ultimately. So that's number two. Number three, David Meerman Scott writes a lot about marketing. He's lucky because he's written books so he's got a massive following, but one of his points that I, that, I, that I read in one of his books was he spends each morning looking for other content to put likes against, to make comments against. You know, it's really important that you engage with others, that you connect with others, you see things that you're interested in, well, let people know or share a thought on something. The other thing I think is really important as this, third, as this third point is repost other people's stuff, but don't repost and put nothing underneath like, or make some glib comment like, I like this. Why do you like this? Write something in your repost, which is your expression of why you like what, what, uh, and the reason why you're reposting. Reposting is a really big deal. I love seeing reposts and looking at what other people think about what they've reposted. Like it or hate it, I want to know that stuff. Again, we're building community. Number four, reach back to people in your community. I often look at people that make comments and I'll ping them and I'll say, let's chat. I actually have plenty of calls just off of within my sort of social media network and it's mostly just to get to know people. You know, there's no real agenda there. Most of the time the agenda is, let me find out about something you've said or let me find out a bit, little bit more about your world. That's not really an agenda. That's building a relationship and, in, and enhancing what you know. So again, that's part of building community, part of building connections with people. The fifth one is the, is the not to do. Um, don't go in and, and tell people privately to take posts down. That's a real no-no. It's, it's not happened to me very often, but if you want to make a comment on a post, or if you, if you, don't, if you disagree with the post, or if you find it objectionable, whatever it might be, put a comment in the post. Share that with the community, have other people give their thoughts on that. Do they agree with you? Do they disagree with you? But if you send a private message to someone and say, take that post down because I find it offensive, really not the way to do things. So you know, avoid number five. So there are my five things of do's to don'ts in geospatial. I think that still LinkedIn and the social media world is, is not utilized as it could be. It's still used in an old marketing style way. You're really community building in social media and you always have to have it in your mind. And, that's, and that building is based on your passions, what you feel like, what you want to be talking about. So use it wisely and use it effectively. That's my advice for you for today. Thanks for watching.